the man down on his luck, mounting his trusty steed and riding south. It sounds like a classic western, but it's modern day. And the trouble is, the horse is malnourished and the man is now under arrest. Local 10's Victor Akendo live now outside the jail in West Miami Dade with our story tonight. Victor. Calvin Chris Emerson was booked into jail. He is waiting to see a judge. In the meantime, we're getting a look at his mugshot. Here he is. His horse will need months to recover after he rode it nearly 700 miles. His back is very sensitive. He gets really mad if you touch it. The uh, slightest touch and triggers entire body shakes. He's malnourished and run down, now in the care of the SPCA. Trigger's owner, Chris Emerson, is in jail, charged with animal abuse for trying to ride him all the way from South Carolina to Key West. Going head south. All the way to Key West. All to Key West. Our sister station caught up with Emerson in Palm Beach. I was just had a bad rough patch with my uh, wife. Got a divorce, got a wreck with truck. The journey began in Greenville, covering nearly 700 miles all the way to Miami. Along the way, concern for Trigger. The story spread on social media. One Facebook post generating hundreds of comments and shares. Ribs, you can see the individual vertebrae, his hip bones, and all the bones on the horse. It gets worse. Trigger is blind in one eye. Pupil is, it won't dilate at all, okay? But it, deep, deep to that, it's white, and that's because there's scar in there. It will take a lot of time and care before Trigger recovers. He'll be at the SPCA property in southwest Miami-Dade for the foreseeable future. He's just not in any fit physical condition to be ridden, much less be ridden the number of miles that this guy has ridden horse. Emerson's bond about will likely be at least $6,000. The SPCA says that if he ever wants to see Trigger again, he'll have to go to court. In West Miami-Dade tonight, I'm Victor Okendo, Local 10 News. Victor, thank you.